We're late to the party, but Forza has added the Hennessy Exorcist, which is kind of funny to me just because it's actually one of the most recreatable vehicles if you were to start with the stock Z011 LE that's already in the game and you just do some bolt-ons to it. But essentially, Forza just added all of it in one package on its own so that you don't have to work to build it up. But instead, you do have to work and play all the seasons worth and all the races and all that stuff Too and much. complete the story and all that to, to get it. I did not do that. I just spent all of my earnings and blew 8 million in the auction house for one. So we are going to test it because I can technically, I guess, do it in real life, but I don't want to put in the work for that either. So we're going to do it virtually in a video game and put it up against its main rivals, the Dodge Demon, because Exorcist being a play on vanquishing the demon. That's its natural enemy. But we're also gonna include the GT500 because that's probably Ford's biggest muscle car competitor towards those other two. And we're just gonna do a little Hennessy Exorcist shootout today. I'm here with Zach and Reese. They can go inside and build. Hey, what's and up, when guys? I mean build, literally just hey, paint it. And that's it because uh, we're gonna basically be doing our, our science under stock setting so we're not going to alter anything that forza has given us i'm preparing to just get absolutely gapped dude if the hennessy doesn't beat the demon in a drag race that's going to be really awkward <laughs> and zach <laughs> yeah, has told like, me I that have... if i do he actually has backup plans in the dodge demon for if i have he loses. a secret weapon see i have an excuse because this is a this is a track car this isn't a drag car well guess what you ain't gonna be the only track car out here it's the beauty of the exorcist it's it's the all-in-one a thousand crank horsepower but we got the one le wheels one le uh or just you know thick tires to go along with those wheels we got the one le aero um good suspension brakes all of that so this thing will corner this is what she looks like in game the only difference is that you get that banner. You obviously get the stripe, but someone could paint the stripe. And then you get this little Hennessy badge that's on the back bumper. I actually, okay, I've been waiting to say this because I noticed this. Forza has messed up. When you get it, it says Camaro Exorcist 2019. The 2019 ZL1s actually have different taillights. They have the, the, the sketcher lights, as some people refer to them, the, the bubbly taillights that they swapped onto. This car is labeled as a 2019, and it has the 2018 only taillights on a 1 Elite. So I, 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 it's clearly, I think it's just some slight error, or maybe it's referring to as the exorcist itself was built in 2019 but that also still wouldn't make any sense because the car is still based on the 20 anyways this is supposed to be 2018 or if it was a 19 it'd have different taillights but i'm gonna go to designs now the coolest thing about this is that if i search to current car literally i just gotta put it out there most popular download someone already did did the glorious thing and uh our car right there is already number one it's funny specifically that one actually isn't the most detailed or at least i guess correct there was someone else that made one that's a little less popular but he got everything to the t so i'm gonna load this design i'm just gonna leave it at that i'm not gonna touch any sort of engine mods or anything because we're doing some forza science here today and Robic. Forza should have actually, if I go over to my cars, the PI for this car factory is 857. And then I have my stock ZL11 LE, which I believe comes at 824. Or maybe that's with exhaust or something like that. But it, it does have upgraded PI. And the other funny thing is that they really did like make sure is that the power rating right there is just a thousand. It, this should be much quicker than a regular ZL1 is in the game and then reese is in the mustang here so yeah we got the gt500 ah uh, yes there is the demon a couple things to note is that we noticed the z one or the exorcist that they added is manual which shout out to forza that's cool and then the demon also is a manual demon right yeah which isn't realistic but for some reason forza made this car shift like a manual so there you go. <laughs> what do you mean Genius. it's not realistic because there's no re all the demons are auto they're all eight-speed autos. Which, There's, are you sure? Which ones are manual? Yep. I don't. I know it's not the demons or the scats or Hellcats. But there, that there straight is up is chart. a demon in the game, dude. That's right. more of that's a bigger issue than them mislabeling this car as a 2019. <laughs> That's what I'm saying, dude. Because essentially they've created a manual demon, which if if you're correct, it doesn't exist. It doesn't exist, bro. 
building the world's first manual Dodge Deep. <laughs> well, there you go. <laughs> considering well, that there's a video that says building the world's first manual Dodge Demon and it's completely totaled. Uh, yeah, I'm seeing automatic only. Dude, how did yeah. Forza? How did Forza mess that up? What? <laughs> Dude, that would, this video. Is, <laughs> that would bother me if I was a demon owner. You don't even get the right? correct transmission. If you go in Forza Vista, can you see like a manual? No, it's paddle. So the guy inside <laughs> shifts like a paddle shifter. Wait, so then how are you saying it's manual? If I shift the car, it sh it shifts like a manual does in this game. Meaning like he fully lets off the gas and then like it goes on again. It doesn't, doesn't shift like an auto. Like it Okay, so fast. it actually is an auto in the game, but it just doesn't oh. shift like one. Right. All right. Well, you should have clarified that because I'm pretty sure everyone would drive it in the game and realize that it actually is set in auto. Essentially, we have a manual Camaro, Sorry. an automatic Dodge, which shifts like a manual in-game, <laughs> and then and we have an actual automatic auto. Mustang because so they only made yeah. the GT500 in, uh, what is it? Is it dual clutch at least? Yes. Uh, yeah, it's a decent yeah, yeah, DCT. I'm gonna set up an actual drag race for this, but let's actually get this show on the road. Everything that Hennessy has stood up for against Dodge by labeling this thing the Exorcist is about to prove itself. Okay, that's funny. I mean, it's not even S1 class. <laughs> <laughs> That's not Run looking good. So Although uh, I don't know, I have I have a weird feeling that this exorcist may not. Be. We'll see. We'll see. Oh! Oh! I oh? had an awful launch. I had an awful launch. I didn't see this coming. Oh, I'm coming though. No, you're not. I'm I'm oh, yeah, I'm gonna reel you in. The demon's <laughs> gone. <laughs> uh. Yo! Demon right. back there though. All right, Demon was mm. back there. Demon, uh, that that race solidified things because I had a pretty poor launch. I was I was just spinning them tires like a thousand horsepower Camaro I would. Have, but I reeled right you in, back. so no matter what, I would say the Exorcist is faster than GT500. Demon yeah. for sure was back there. I think Zach's got to whip out his backup plan. I am going to. Can go I whip out the medium backup plan? Use my toolkit that came with the car. <laughs> Your little suitcase or whatever that came with the Demon. <laughs> yeah. Just right. like in. In uh, classic Grand Tour fashion, I'm gonna go yeah. put on the drag radials. Alright, Zach's gonna, gonna put on the, the demon drag pack that actually yeah. comes with it from Dodge. So we're gonna see if that makes a difference for him. Reese, what do you say you're gonna do? I'm gonna put the semi. <laughs> <laughs> no. I'm gonna put the sport package on. Hey, that's not fair though. <laughs> I don't think Shelby gave a little sport okay. package with some additional. Reese, How you know that? I'll, I'll give you this. You can take off the wing, cause that's realistic. Okay. That's right. what, you what can about do. my wing? <laughs> Ain't nobody uh, stopping anyone from just unbolting now. a 1LE wing. Okay. Yeah, and you also did point. win. So. All right, no, I'm I'm a, I'm gonna keep it as is, and I want to see if your guys' improvements will make a difference. I think Forza has completely done the demon dirty so far because I think in real life a demon actually it should definitely be a manual exorcist, like just the automatic trans. Yeah, just, I would think. it was designed so. to be a drag racing machine. And how much uh, wheel horsepower does a demon have again? I think they're actually rated like people have dynoed them at like 840 wheel like or 800 I should say I don't know like exactly yeah because pretty decent. the exorcist wheel horsepower is 860 so I mean 800 wheel horsepower Dodge versus 860 wheel horsepower Camaro but the Dodge is automatic I think I think a demon would actually beat an exorcist flat out IRL but in the game they're doing the demon dirty it's only a class it said it says it makes 800 something what horsepower crank right and then it says well, I, I don't it know. says the, that's the thing I don't understand in Forza if it's like the crank or wheel horsepower number that they're showing well I can I tell you know. right now it's the crank number because if I go to change car my number says a thousand and I know that it's a thousand crank horsepower what does your power figure say on your your car list 840 yeah, so in the if Forza is actually like cohesive and consistent with their horsepower figures, I would assume they're all crank horsepower. My other argument also to the fact that Forza power figures are in crank is that my stock V10 Plus R8s are measured at 610, and that is purely the crank horsepower of the Gen 2 R8 and not the wheel horsepower. Got so, it. so yeah, okay. I believe they all have crank horsepower figures. You got your drag pack on? Yes, I do. Yes. Say so I look like a base model GT with one of the eBay bum bumpers that people may try to make their cars look like. Oh, yeah. GT Is that just the car without a wing? Yeah. 
They don't it have does, the, like, dude, Yeah, no, you things. do look like, yeah, you look like a base <laughs> Mustang, and every every base Mustang owner's got to put the GT500 bumper on there. <laughs> Half of them aren't even painted. They can't even afford the paint, so they always be, like, <laughs> black up primer. front. But, yeah, no, it really does look like that. But, nah, he he just a sleeper. What, what's, the, the, what's, what's the Shelby? Anyway? Yeah, what's the Shelby power figures? I can't check. Power is, like, 760, yeah. 760 crank? Yeah. yeah. Damn, that's actually yeah. He's you don't got that much power in this in this. That's fight. what I was saying. I did not yeah. think that I was gonna do as well as I did. I'm pretty sure you're also 40 to 100, which is pretty nuts. It I'm is, gonna try and make my launch good, but it's really hard to like measure out when to upshift when your wheels are spinning and you're just at red line. Just pepper it. Oh what? Dang! <laughs> there we go, dude. There's that drag pack he was talking I about. I can't tell if that launch was worse than the last one. I tried to, like, ease into <laughs> it Am more. I reeling? I'm reeling. Yeah. I'm, I'm reeling. reeling. I'm coming. Oh, I'm come coming. On. Come on. No, let's take not. the demon. Let's take the demon. Not. No. Not. no. I still got you. Let's do that again. <laughs> also, Dude, do you, launch, have, do you have the launch always. control thing on, Jack? Oh, wait. I'm, either either you turn it on or I can turn mine off. One of the two. But I know. I need launch control. I need launch control. I'm definitely getting gapped this time. My launch control did not. How how was I able to use the launch control at all in that scenario? <laughs> it nah, just I guess started. Like cause I just hold the gas down. Yeah, me too. It's, yeah, I'm guessing it's cause I have the tires that actually open up. It actually looked like you didn't even leave until like half a second. Dude, after. Because I was holding the A to do the launch control, and then like. Uh. Okay, the start right though, like let's it just, just starts immediately. Only. Hold the gas. All right, we're gonna run it back again. <laughs> <laughs> Jack's like, I'm not winning. Dude, as far as didn't, I know, didn't the Grand Tour have like, haven't they like had this scenario where like they just can't get the launch controls right, so it's like a million drag races. Yeah. I think I've seen that at least like twice on that trio. <laughs> I'm wondering if Reese gets off better off the line because nope. of the DCT. I mean, so far you've been having better launches than me still yeah i haven't it's like i'm reeling you i'm reeling everybody in at this point because i'm definitely reeling mm -hmm. in the dodge now with his tires this is it the final come on race <laughs> all right well come on, let me go let me go come on you're gonna reel right. me back in i need to get a jump that was as good of a start oh, as a i was ever gonna shit. get Oh, Man. my shit did horribly the tires right add come so on. much to this oh whoa you are coming yo fast. i'm coming in Oh, dude, oh, just I couldn't reel that. in the demon no matter dude the demon Man. with the drag pack is pretty unbeatable And I think that's pretty <laughs> realistic. I will say it's crazy dude because I have I weigh I'm curious what the exorcist weighs That's what I want to see too because I have a lot less power and more weight, it seems. But the grip but is Zach. so helpful. Oh man, this dude just emoting on us right now. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see if you just put like regular sex yeah. licks on. Because uh, what you're getting us on is a launch. Here, what I'm going to do is put on the race, like regular race tires. Because I think like the drag tires in this game are pretty unrealistic. So, oh, yeah. <laughs> guys, my weight, I, I believe I'm still set to like. English units or something, because my weight is seventeen hundred kilograms. Can someone do the conversion? Can someone do the conversion rate on that, please? <laughs> Someone's gotta convert that to bald eagle units. Oh wow! So you're five hundred pounds lighter than both of us, pretty much. Really? No, he's got me by three fifty, I think. Okay, so I'm the lightest, then the Mustang, then the Demon. Yeah, I'm the heaviest. Yeah. Dang. You're thirty one hundred, bro. So the That's Demon's got. Million. All right, let's just run this through real quick. So for the last drag race, which was probably the best we're going to get, from a dig, the demon is the heaviest, it's got the least power, and yet it smoked us all. Actually, I don't have the least power. I have it's the launch. Least. Oh, yeah. No, no, no. But, Actually, second least. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the Shelby but, has yeah. least power, but you don't have yeah. as much Dude, power as me, according to the game. We're going to do a roll now. I guess since Forza roads are so big, we could probably actually fit three of us on this road. <laughs> we could do 40 roll. You're definitely going to pull on us. But in, the second half of the drag race is pretty much what we're about to do right now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, it's pretty obvious so, the Exorcist might take this based on right. the, the dig race, but you know what? Let's let's get up to let's, 40. We got to figure it out i mean this allows me to uh what do you call it not have to worry about my launches all right yeah your horn's gonna do it dude the mustang is still fast wow the demon's weight wow. just hit. It's the auto dude 
It's that, it's that man. Yeah, it's, it's that DCT. Got that DCT DCT action. on the Shelby. Oh, Yo. that's a galant. Alright. I'm now... I mean, what happens if we keep going? Because, dude, this car maxes out at 200. I'm on, dude. You would, you would essentially, you should I'm have close, a, you should honestly. have a quicker final drive than me. Oh, we're actually at 204. Wait, I just realized, how is this possible? <laughs> I'm proving, I'm proving here. an inaccurate fact right here. This car is going 211. Wait. 212. Am I pulling? 213. Oh, I'm pulling. Oh, he's. Are oh, you I'm now? Pulling. Oh, you are. <laughs> I'm, I'm 214. I'm stuck. I'm going Where are you 220. at? Two, 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 220. Oh. Did you not just crash into that on your screen? Speed zone. Oh, he's gone. Wow. Nice. All right. Oh, wow. I'm 218 now. <laughs> what? <laughs> what in the world? I'm, pit, I'm stopped at 220. All right, all right, I'm all right. at 204. We got to have a discussion about this, okay? Okay. So what that was was that it, initially that was going to be a roll race, but it turned into basically just a speed war in between these cars. Going. And, uh, oh yeah, top God. speed, uh, the Shelby <laughs> is by far the quickest. I think it might help that you don't have a rear wing because that speeds at that yeah. level. That definitely makes a, should make a difference. Um, the other funny thing is I... Uh, don't ask where, but I've personally proved that the, the top speed of a manual exorcist is 200 miles an hour because in six gear, you will actually hit limiter and you'll run out of gear. And this car is a manual in the game and it went 218. So Hennessy's proved that an exorcist with an auto can go 217. But yeah, something ain't adding up here. That was another inaccuracy. This car should have actually been, uh, if the gear ratios were exactly how they are, this thing should have just been hitting limiter at 200 miles an hour. We should do a race, a circuit race. Because we'll really oh, see, I, we'll really know. see where the Dodge can fall on its face. Because these other two are track monsters. I've already lost. Let two me put of my ring on. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, no you, yeah, you've lost two of the three, trip. and the only one you've won is due to uh, some tires. Hey, man, the tires came with Dodge, so it's all fair. It's all fair. I'm not complaining. In in the process of putting the wing back on, give me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you gotta put your wing back on because uh, you know we're doing some cornering now. He's got to bring back his arrow. Here we go. Oh, and oh I just realized your your class. SPI got like bumped up extremely because of the, slicks. the tires. The other slicks. Oh, oh wait. So are you on track slicks now? Like I'm on like, race slicks. Your race I slicks. To okay. Do, yeah. So this is like even this is unrealistic. But you're All still right. gonna beat me. We're doing a little little street circuit. Oh boy, I have a feeling if my driving isn't good enough that this Mustang is gonna have me. So we gotta try here. We're breaking a lot of traction everywhere we go. So what happens with the thousand horsepower? I don't know where I'm going. I'm just driving through the city. Okay, okay bro, you have a driver there. driver air over there. You're not doing <laughs> the Shelby mod, driver mod. Driver D mod. It's not doing the yeah. Shelby what it deserves. I will say I don't know if it's the fact that I mean Forza probably added this how you would get one from Hennessy, meaning that it would just have their headers, but it would come with the stock ZL1 exhaust, but. I don't know, man. I feel like sound-wise, it kind of lacks a little bit of the, the yeah. scream <laughs> and the chop. What's going on your, back there? Your big body just absolutely wrecked me. Stop! Oh Stop. boy! <laughs> He's bodying the horse. Yeah. Dude, I just got absolutely slammed. I'm, uh, the demon has uh, come out from hell, and it is just raining I'm all this over race the place. Like a sideshow, so I'm just running into everybody. <laughs> as I go okay, okay. Zach's just and, staying and in character. Dodge form. What a hell, cat owner. Yeah. Or heck, cat owner. Yeah, I don't see how. Reese, tell me how in the world the demon is how in front are you of in you. Class, bro? Yeah, how? What? Because he a <laughs> Shelby <laughs> GT500, man. Yeah, because he's straight like. Yeah, it's kind of weird how he's back to into a wall. Oh my! Oh, God. you just hit a wall. <laughs> oh, you just hit a wall too. All right. Well, this is a uh, typical jackal tremotive fashion where our street race or circuit race is not <laughs> proving accurate whatsoever. I just hit a building. I guess what's different about this race is I'm actually leading alone instead of in last alone. But nice. maybe I'll keep messing up enough for you guys to catch up. I just watch you guys go. <laughs> I just watch you guys go straight into the wall. <laughs> I was He's trying to force him to wall, stop, but, but then, then I, I it was ghosted. ghosted, so... Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, I think we know the results here. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. I mean, this is where the Exorcist is uh, shining. 
Nah, I'd drive them out in this LV. It would totally win. I just suck. No. Nah. nah, I'm telling you, man. The one LE arrow. It's unmatched. This really is the best track car. Boom. I, I, I don't know. I might be biased, but I think it's the best track car. I'm just saying, you know. I mean, genuinely, man. Like, the, it's the GT500 is way too heavy, dude. Yeah, if the GT500 is much heavier, like like you said, like, yeah, 300 pounds heavier, then on paper, it shouldn't be as good of a track car as the Camaro. I'm just I'm just saying. Right. Reese, did you at least get second for that race? I didn't see. I did. Okay, thank God. <laughs> Ain't no way you <laughs> lose into an absolute land yacht. We've exposed some inaccuracies about the exorcist that forza has added that only someone like me would ever realize i'd never realized that about any of the other cars that they've added but you know if you guys out there own cars that are in the game and you guys have done your own science versus reality virtual testing you guys would discover that for yourselves on the other vehicles but for this one it is frankly the fastest car in a straight line it's the fastest around a track and the only way things are gonna basically get ahead of it are if you put the slicks on the demon or if you're going 218 miles an hour on the freeway 20 that's yeah. well i'm saying when you go 218 that's when the gt500 will overtake because it goes 220 that's according true. to the game so uh yeah that's that's our conclusion but let me know, uh, you know, put, put in the comments down below if you want to see us do some more field tests on some other cars and try and expose some inaccurate data. But for now, this is going to be Jack Ultra Gamer signing this video off.